I want to close with this story. The late Governor Frank Clement used to tell a story about a wise old man. In honor of the wise young women here today, I want to change it up just a little bit. That includes all of you young women of whatever age here today. There once was a wise young woman. She was the wisest person for miles around. If people would come to try to test her or trick her and show that they were smarter than she was, but they never could. And one day a young man came up to her and he held his hands just like this. He said, young woman, this bird I hold in my hands, is it alive or is it dead? And the young woman was wise. And she knew that if she said that bird was dead, the young man was going to open his hands and the bird was going to fly away. But if she said that bird was alive, the young man was going to crush his hands together, crush the life out of the bird, and drop it lifeless to the ground. And so that young woman said to him, she said, young man, that bird's life is as your own. It will be as you will it. It will be as you will it. Ladies and gentlemen, so it will be with us and the people of the 8th District. If we will it, we can have a great future together. We have great opportunities before us. Together we can do that, what we, those things that we ought to do, and we can achieve what we ought to achieve. I'll give you every ounce within me. I won't ever stop working for you if you give me the chance to start every day in every way that I can. I won't forget who sent me up there, and I won't forget where home is. I'll be back all the time. Thank you for being so kind to me in the past. Thank you for what you're doing for me in the future, and I look in the present. And I look forward to working with you in the future. Thank you, and God bless you.